What we see here is a part of two uh, uh, shipwrecks that were found uh, near Caesarea. Uh, the first one is from the Roman period, from the uh, middle uh, 3rd century AD, about 1,300 years ago. And the second one is from the uh, Mamlukid period, which is uh, about the 14th century, about uh, 600 uh, to 700 years ago. Both of them were uh, uh, wrecked in the same site in a difference of 1,000 years, which is not uh, so, uh, 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 it's not something that's happening so often. This ring with, it, with these beautiful gamma belongs to the third century. And we have something quite exceptional here, probably um, a gamma which is like um, a Christian inspired gamma showing the Good Shepherd. So this is really something quite rare. I mean, there are a lot of gem, gem, gemmas, there are a lot of gems like this in uh, collections everywhere all over the world. But to find it in an excavation next to a ring with coins and objects and the remains of a ship, of course, that's extremely, extremely important. And to find it in Caesarea, which was an early Christian, important early Christian community, with a ring in which the symbols are early Christian, well, that's, of course, fantastic. We do find a lot of Roman hoards or Roman coins in, in all kinds of contexts in, in archaeological excavation. This hoard though from the um, Mamluk period is something really rare to find a, a silver hoard uh, like this is one of the first that we have. This is how it's been preserved on the bottom of the sea. But once you start um, cleaning these coins, you can um, identify the rulers and the period of the coins. And we know that this hoard belongs to the third century, the mid third century. <laughs> 